Many local medical offices are offering services through telephone calls, but there are some health appointments that can't do this, especially in the pediatrics field. These in-person appointments have some parents worried. News 13's Melissa Thomas spoke with a local pediatrician on why visits are still safe. One local mother, Megan McDougall, is not sure if her newborn can contract COVID-19. Just stay in his little tush at home <laughs> because I don't really know if he can contract it or not. Or like I think if anyone would get it, it would be him. Local pediatrician Dr. Rubina Azam with Baldwin Pediatrics in Panama City says children are as susceptible as adults to COVID-19, especially those who may be immunocompromised. And children with underlying health conditions like asthma, diabetes, obesity, or any other chronic immune condition are more susceptible, of course, to COVID-19 and the complications. McDougall says her first child received a delayed vaccination schedule to monitor for any side effects, but with the virus, she is trying to decrease visits. I think we might just do the bundles of vaccines that you get like one or two or three at a time. I think I'd probably go more along with that just to keep the trips less. Dr. Azam says it's important to continue immunizing your children on schedule to prevent outbreaks of other kinds such as measles or chickenpox. For the vaccines, come over, stay in the parking lot, and we're going to bring vaccines to you, to your car. McDougall says she hopes as a community we learn from these times. I think and hope that that's everyone's take from all of this is that we can just be more aware and mitigate you know, everyone's risk of all kinds of germs. Dr. Azam stresses a healthy diet, exercise, and good sleep will better protect families. Give you a very strong immune system and gives you the best protection against any infection. In Panama City, Melissa Thomas, News 13, Panhandle Strong.